Back to the shenanigans. Yes, let's do the shenanigans. Dun, 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 dun. Stop. Hammer time. Dun, wait, dun, did, wait. You get, did you get the upgrade sword? I haven't got it on this one yet. I got it on the last one. No, yeah. When we well, forgot to record. Let's go ahead and show everyone that. Yeah, well. Oh, I already got this. I did this earlier in my game. Half magic Mita! Yeah, that's why it says only one half. Yeah. We only got top, half magic. Top left, half magic. We only have half magic because there's a little bat who I will call Beatro or Batatro because. Batatronics. You know. I forget his name. And oh, yeah, yeah. I remember this guy. He's slamming that baguette heart, man. It's My lost stale. partner returns. We could temper your soul, but now I can't do anything for you. I didn't realize he talked like Christopher Walken. Hey! Yeah, he's slamming that baguette. It's pretty stale. That is a stale baguette. Well, go find his posse. His partner, not his posse. His homie. His, his, homie. his hetero life mate. His homie and Rouge. His hetero life mate, like Jay and Bob. What's up, Mr. Frog? Beat his ass. You know, it'd be great if it was like Fallout, where you kill somebody and they never come back. Your body did not change. You know, we're new guy. How would you, you know? You never played Fallout. How do you know I haven't? Because you said you didn't. You telling me you're a liar right here, right now? I am a Ben Carson. I am a pathological liar. <laughs> Let's do our best not to bring up politics. Oh, man. I know. It's so hilarious. It's so much material. It's like all the materials. It would be great had you just like walked back through my portal and then from the mirror and just got stuck in the little dark world again. Dude, no, no, no. <laughs> go, go adventuring with this guy with you. What? Wink and the Dwarf? Yeah. I can see it happening. Dude, I think you just came up with a really good miniseries. <laughs> it's it's Gimli and it's Gimli and Legolas. Oh, oh, God. God. <laughs> Yay. Okay, no, never mind. Take him, put him back there. <laughs> I'm here again. We can temper your sword now. Temper my dick. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you. Temper my butt. <laughs> That's the kind of humor I can expect to hear from Jacoby. Oh, God. It, it says uh, the most well read guy of our group. <laughs> Uh, Are you better red than he is? Uh, let's right. see here. I read Metro 2033. Is he read Metro 2033? <laughs> no. <laughs> I have read Shadows of the Empire. Has he read Shadows of the Empire? No one will admit to the books you're reading right now. I doubt. What? Shadows of the Empire was probably the best of all the Star Wars expanded universe. Anyone who doesn't agree is just trying to annoy me. Which, I admit, it's a fun pastime. Man, you're just tearing up that garden. And that that insect is not having it. Doesn't want to be any part of that. That's a bird. That's a bird. Skeletal bird of doom. Man, it is just flinging out of there. Let's see, what other books have I read that he has? Well, I did read the Gnostic books. Those are pretty impressive. The Gnostic Gospels? Yeah. You hmm. learned a lot of stuff. There's a lot of deleted scenes. Like when uh, Jesus went on, uh, he was a, a, an angsty teenager. <laughs> And, and he used all his, I don't want to know, do I? He used all his miracle powers to just do bomb ass skateboard tricks. Like he did. At least he went with bomb ass skateboard tricks. He I did a 180 going. twist manual across the water. Did he now? Yes. 180 twist manual, huh? Yes. And then he did a Christ air. <laughs> <laughs> Makes perfect sense. Yes. The ultimate skateboard move. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I remember one of the skate games. I think it was the second one. I would just do that and dive into traffic while doing the Christ. Air. Woo! I got an orange lightsaber. It's a heat sword. It's like a hot knife through butter. Okay, snake. Snake. Actually, snake. actually, if you Solidus must know, snake. actually, if snake. you must know snake. who I was being, there was Solidus Gabe. Snake. I was being Gabe Logan from Siphon Filter. I don't know place I can build it. It's uh, something. I, I've heard it is something. My favorite one was Omega String, because I like playing as my own character in games. It's coming for me! It's coming for me! <laughs> oh, I'm having fun. You having fun? Grab later? the landing skids! <laughs> yes. Grab Man, that guy's always chasing after you, and he's always disappointed by the fact he's, that he can't catch you. He's like, wait. You know, that's, that's a really good metaphor for life right there. It is. 
I keep chasing I after also, I want. I also chase after things with my heat sword. <laughs> uh, you probably shouldn't run with that sword. Especially when it's like glowing and molten. You know, one of these days you're going to come back and he's going to have like a Sam sight and he's just going to be blasting you down with missiles. <laughs> Somewhere there is a... I don't know. There's a portal somewhere. But we must swim towards it. Swim to the pulse hall. Are we ready for the next dungeon? Yeah. Let's go. Let's do it. There's your portal down there yeah. in the water. Waiter? Water. The water? Water. Water bottle. Oh, yeah. Bottle. I'm not going to remember this. I don't... Oh, throw all the rupees in there. Okay. Hey, how about that? More money equals more luck. That's how it should work. Right. That's what Ayn Rand thinks. Oh no! Wow, so you can't really have good luck unless you just take a dump in the pool, huh? Yeah, pretty much. I think it's a hundred rubies. I have to do this five times. Great luck! Wake up! I want to give you some rupees! Why don't you just empty your bag and just I know, right? Don't let me. Your happiness is 65. Big trouble. What? Little Chinatown. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not how it works. I just gave you $65, Magic Fountain. You can give me some luck. I'm going to dive right in there and swoop oh, them back out. Good luck. Oh, well, I'm happy about that. This is the worst fortune cookie ever. Big trouble in Little China. Yes. Is it, is it Little China or Little Chinatown? I it's Little China. Oh, that's it. Give me something good to eat. Ooh. Oh, that's what she is. I want to carry more bombs. I want to blow up the world. <laughs> well, that's what, a lot, you know... Every, every year, I'm telling you this, I'm serious. What? Every year I write a letter, letter to Santa. And he doesn't answer? Well, he probably shouldn't. Uh, my aunt, my request is I always want it, I want to decide who dies. I want to be the final arbiter of that. But so far, Santa is not willing to comply with that request. Well, oh, all right. I, know what I she want does. to be... The deathly judgment on the world. You want to be Judge Dredd? Yes. I am the law. Of the land? No, just the law. You did Judge Jerry and Executioner? Jesus, it's cold over here. Oh, yes. Are you ready to fight the Mighty Ducks again? See, yes. Alright, let's just go in. <laughs> yes. See, our previous one, we named these creatures in here because apparently they don't have names or they've never appeared in other. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot about this guy. Hey. Ice Zombie. What, what, did we name this one? I don't know what to name it. But I do like how they have those easy storage racks. Oh man, that guy's licking them. Really? Do you want to stop here? Or are we gonna go to this dungeon let's just, too? Let's finish it up. All right, let's finish it. Finish it. No. Test your might. Liu King. Raiden. Johnny Cage. All right, now this is gonna be blast me to a lot. Of, yeah, there you go. There you're mighty dust. Sub Zero. Yeah, just, <laughs> Sonya. Just love sliding around Mortal on their stuff. Combat. Okay, I know this is going to be blasphemous to a lot of people, but I never really got too much in a world combat. 
You don't like it? No, it's not that I don't like it. It's just that there are a lot of other games I was playing. No, I was like, you, I was going to say, you don't like the spine ripping out thing? Oh, I do. Because that's fantastic. Yeah, that's cool. That's like the best one. See, okay, I, this is going to draw maybe some huge fan amusement or not. I played this fighting game called Eternal Champions on the Sega Genesis. And that, oh, wow, these guys are really going at it. Wow! It's going so much, it's slowing the game. Man. I know. That's, so, I, that's terrible. You know what they're doing? You know what they're doing? They're freezing the game. Ah! I get it, because we're in a nice level. <laughs> I hate you so much right now. You know you love it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I played Eternal Champions, and I love that game. I always played as Rax. He was the cyborg kickboxer. Yeah, that's cool. So he was Jax from Mortal Kombat. No. no. Mortal Kombat got the idea from Eternal Champions. I don't know. I'm pretty sure Mortal Kombat is older than whatever game you just said. Do we need to play that? What, Eternal Champions? Eternal Champions. Are you kidding? Yeah. I've never heard of it. That's great. I loved it. Oh, well, hell. Yeah, me and my older yeah. brother played that game like crazy. Oh, there's Nessie out barking outside. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and say this. I really love ice levels. Like, is there shenanigan? I, I don't even know why. It's There's no real it, reason why I like them. It's because they're ridiculous. I like them, too. Like, they're frustratingly difficult, and that makes them a lot of fun. Like, probably one of my favorite Sonic maps is Diamond Dust Zone. I don't know why. I think it's also because the music's really cool. But, I don't know, I just always... I like that. I can vaporize them, and I have to deal with the little guys. Yeah, that's something. And you just walk right into it. Okay. Yeah, well, I thought I had to try and set up a shot. Yeah, it's something, something about ice maps. Even the ice area in the uh, Ninja Gaiden Xbox game. I liked it. It was cool. Mm -hmm. um, Except for that ice demon thing. That guy was a pain. Ah! You know what killed the dinosaurs? Did you touch yourself at night? No. Different reference. Uh, oh, yeah. This guy's cool as hell. He's cool as hell. Yeah. Good God. Ice hey, to meet you. Hey, Are we going to hey, do hey, Mr. Hey, hey. Freeze references? That's exactly what I was doing. Uh, chill out. <laughs> <laughs> you know Motherfucker. What, you know what killed the dinosaurs? Yeah, you touching yourself at night. Oh, the you Ice Age. Ah, <laughs> except now. Yeah, except the Ice Age came in with a gun and just blasted the dinosaurs away. Using down the street in my 6-4, I missed the key. Dinosaur this lives matter. <laughs> you trying to get us in trouble. <laughs> well, no. Yeah. Look, I'm not making light of the situation. I'm not making fun of it. I'm just saying, I genuinely think dinosaur lives matter. Well, they do. Especially if you're uh, Chinese. Well, yeah. They grind them down more heavy. Yeah. Dragon bones. <sighs> and we lost a lot of knowledge from the Chinese world. Because of that. Yeah, and they keep killing all our fucking rhinos, too. Chinese do? Yeah. No. Traditional medicine dictates that anything that's remotely penis-shaped helps you with your penis. So, of course, by that logic, it's very obvious to see that a rhino horn is going to just make you straight up, you know... You have big American penis! It's going to straight up make you Will Chamberlain. <laughs> Chamberlain. Will Chamberlain? Will Chamberlain, yeah. The Knight Chamberlain? Yes. What if they were... <laughs> Is that a South Park one? Yeah. That's okay. South Park. I don't remember. They do, they do an he, Night Shyamalan episode yeah. on South Park? No, he's not an episode. He just he has a small role in one of the episodes. Okay. Yeah. Still, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> oh. Look at this. They've got a defensive line set up. You know what it is? Or an offensive the line. The Flying V! I like these guys. And you say they never appear in any other ones? Nope. They really need to be in Ocarina of Time when there's, I think, the, uh, oh, there's a, there's some Yetis in uh, Twilight Princess. Oh, they're pretty cool. No, they need to bring back these Mighty yeah. Ducks. The Mighty Ducks are fantastic. It's such a great name for them, too. Yes, you're welcome. Oh, yeah, I remember that this, that, that, that section of the area, uh, the um, ice 
dungeon. Nice dungeon. Uh, you're standing on all these TV monitors. Oh, mother trucker. Ah! Well, if there's a key there, I won't know. See, you got all these HD monitors. What was exhibit in here and pimped out this lair? <laughs> hey. I heard you like watching TV while you're Life. working on your car. That, that's one of the things. Like, <laughs> why would they put TVs underneath the car? Oh, so you can watch them while you're working, you know, while you're working on your car. No, that's fine. I call it Spider-Man tactic. It was. See, those things in the middle, they look like she, they should have, like, an eye or something. What things? Those mm. those spike things that you just bring to. Yeah, I think they do, actually. You should have, like, a little eye in the middle. Oh. Well, you thought wrong. Oh, dang it. I gotta go up to go down. That's what, how it works in the business world. No, I don't know that. But, um, you mean you have to go down to get up? Mm -hmm. Well, also, that that's no also how it works with say. Funk. you got to get down. Funk Town. Uptown, Funk You Up. Yes. Uptown, Funk You Up. Yes, we're dating ourselves with music. That was from last year. Yes. Thank you. Now you just narrowed it down even further. We, these are supposed to be timeless classic. Well, they'll never be timeless. <laughs> well, this will be a timeless classic. The game we're playing. But. Yeah, yeah, this, which is a great game. I, don't know. I like those smiling guys. I'm like, ah, you can't hit us. And you just totally wail on them. Oh, God. Hit it. Turn into a rabbit. You know, I feel like Ganon's just sitting there somewhere like, ah. Yeah, Ganon's be in the big control room just throwing the stuff at you. Dude, those are so cool. I love those skeleton guys. Pull that tongue. I'll get there. Nope. We have to get the conch. Oh, yeah. The cornucopia. Um, yeah, well, that's what it is now. What was it, Tom and Jerry? You just pull his tongue out and then slap it back in his head. And yeah. It, it rolls like a... Like a like, uh, you mean itchy and scratchy? No. I, I know what... <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Well, that's definitely not what I'm talking about. <laughs> Why is it not what you're talking about? We got the big key. We are the big key. Well, Where do we scratching. need to go? Oh, oh shit, that reminds me. There was this oh, 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 Simpsons oh. fighting game. Oh, yeah, there was. And you could have Itchy and Scratchy. And Scratchy, whichever one's the mouse, I don't know which one. Scratchy's the mouse. Scratchy was a total bitch. <laughs> he was overpowered as hell. Oh, yeah. And my brother, my younger brother, would just play as him exclusively. So, of course, I would bound to lose just because of the fact that it wasn't balanced at all. You remember uh, they did a Crazy Taxi with the Simpsons as Homer? Yes. It's fantastic. It was all right. Yeah, it was about as great as that. You get slapped by that spinning thing. Why are these HDTVs so slick? Yes. Uh, well, technically, they really shouldn't be in this temple because they were stolen and they're hot. <laughs> God, Leonard. No. You that's know. that's terrible. You know you loved it. Don't put, search your feelings. You know it to be true. <laughs> terrible joke. <laughs> no, I loved it. Wait, this is the way I came in, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah. This place is kind of disorientating. Ask one of those friendly yetis. Serengetis? Ah! Ask one of those snow ghosts. Snow beasts? It was snow ghost. It was a... What was that? It was a... Oh, Scooby-Doo character. Slowbro? Snow Ghost. Slow bro. <laughs> There's another good video game story. There was a Scooby-Doo game, I think, for the N64. <laughs> and uh, I was playing it and uh, you know, when I was a kid. And the part with the Snow Ghost, for whatever reason, one of the times that he was chasing me, the glitch, the game glitched slightly, so he he had no leg movement animation, so he was just gliding across the map chasing me. <laughs> and I remember it was so funny because I was like, "Holy shit, I'm scared too now, Shaggy." Why does this sound like the Yeti from uh, Ski Free? 
Yes, Ski Free. Oh my god. I could have sworn, as a kid, I thought, okay, there's got to be some way to get past this goddamn Yeti. There never was. Actually, there was. Really? Yeah. I forget how you do it, but you had to keep running that way from him. Dude, no, he homed in on you. He would oh, use his turbo boosters. No, he, he did. I'm not saying he didn't use his turbo boosters. I'm saying there is a way to get rid of them and keep the game going. I just can't remember. No, I details. think you're lying. I don't believe you. I don't believe you on the grounds of one thing. What? You're lying. Oh, okay. If you weren't lying, I'd believe you. Well, I am do I am in trying to access my inner Carson right now. So. Stop it. I'm running in circles. You are. It's almost like I'm in an ice palace. Mm -hmm. Oh, what was the ice... Ice area in uh, one of the Pokemon games. One of the trainers had an ice temple area. Ice to meet you. Yes. Well, the guy on the island had uh, the magma chamber. Um, no, I was one of the. It was. I think it was in gold. And it was silver. After. Yeah. Pew. Where in the hell am I going here? I don't know. Don't you got one of those map things? I do. It's pretty cool. It can pinpoint your position. It's, I have to keep going down is my deal. Yes, go down. Going down, down, in lily red. Chicken, we're going down, swinging. Be another one with the bullet. You should stop that. Little, 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 cock, and pulling. You know what's great? Everywhere across work. What? People come to your cubicle to hear you serenade them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Serenade me like one of your French girls, Andrew. I hear it all the time. Man, oh. you, you, when you're, uh, when you're swinging, you're swinging, and you're swinging when you're singing. I, I don't know what to say to you on that one. Dash across. <sighs> yes, brandishing your sword like an idiot. It's for, it's for balancing purposes. Oh right, right. I'm sure that's exactly what it's for. There we go. Zug, 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 zug. Hey kid, you did a great job today. Job? Job. Oh man, that guy's gonna give you such a warm hug. Yeah, Take that Olaf. He just died down there. Okay, here's another thing that's gonna rouse some people. Oh. Seen frozen. Oh, you haven't seen frozen? Woo! I got a blue suit, bitches. And you got a tan hat? Blue suit, tan hat. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. Dude, why didn't you get a record deal? You are so incredibly talented. Did, thank, did, thank you, man. Did you sense the sarcasm? I, I sensed the sarcasm. Good, because that's how I meant it. <laughs> yeah, what the hell was that? <laughs> that tickled. Stop hitting me. Ice to meet you. Let's kick some ice. <laughs> It'll be a cold day in hell when you be... Whoa! Wait, you should train under him as a mint, you know, as a student, so you could learn how to do those jump steps. Yeah, well, I think that's what happened in the future of the games. Yeah. Jump attack. Yeah, I like his pauldrons. They just, they're so regal. What are you doing? You're supposed to get him on the button. No, you don't remember? No, I don't remember anything. Buttons to go through the door. Oh, wait. Damn it, I don't have a key. Yeah, it's almost like I was right about that or something. No. Yes, yeah. I am. Shut up. Please. I'll kill you, Leonard. I'll kill you. Do it. Do it now! You can't kill a person who's, like, eager for it. It's not really murder. At least when it comes to me, anyway. Ah, uh, there's the key. I have to find the switch. Old bait and switch. That was a great accidental toss there on my part. <laughs> Hope you all like that mad skill. That's what it was. Yeah, mad well. 
Yeah, that was mad skill, all right. Straight up baller G, dude. What we got here? Another key? Another key. You, wait, 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 wait. Get, let me get the. What was it? Uh, who's the Daedric character who gives you a, a skeleton key? Can we do that mission? So, have you played Fallout? I have not played Fallout. Okay, you need to play Fallout. Totally serious. Listen, if the Smithsonian Institute declares it as art, that's something. Did they declare it art? Yeah, they did. And you know what else they declared art? A link to the past. Middle Gear Solid. Now, see, that's when I know you're making straight No. Up. No, you can look it up yourself, buddy. They also declared a bunch of other dumbass crap art. Um, like, uh... You just call Metal Gear dumbass. Yeah. That's right. That's right. I appeal to you. Um... No, it was on the list. Uh, let's see, what are some of the other games that they... They had Mass Effect. I'm okay, doing this kind of, all wrong. Mass Effect's good. Uh, they had World of Warcraft, which... That shouldn't be called art. Which, while I do not enjoy it, it's definitely an art piece from the marketing perspective. Uh, I guess you want to make that argument. That's very true. It's a great one. It's basically crack. Though less fulfilling. <laughs> How do you not see him coming? <laughs> I don't know. You did it twice. I'm going the wrong effing way in this dungeon, and I just know it. Oh, I'm loving it, though. You know. Maybe you need to cool down. Think about where all you're going. Spinach chin. Yuck, yuck. Whoop, whoop. Ninja vanish. You see those uh, bobble kits I posted? You liked them. Oh, yeah. The Ninja Turtle ones. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Oh, I remember what you gotta do. Yeah, I just have to figure out where that damn switch is at. Look for the taint. I thought it was upstairs somewhere. But I wanted to come get this key and open this door. And... <laughs> yes. Ah, oh, now you're a rabbit. Take that. Now you can't have tricks, you piece of shit. All the boys in the hood. You know, that's something, too. Why didn't the Trix Rabbit just, like, beat the shit out of the kids? He was significantly bigger than them. <laughs> Actually, no, he's pretty skinny. Well, yeah, but he also has powerful rabbit legs. He should have just laid on his back and just kicked one of them right in the face. Sure, Leonard. Yes, he should have. That would have teach those kids to be discriminatory. Who the hell are they to tell me who can and cannot have tricks? Piece of shit. I can't stand that. People, people who discriminate against other people based on the color of their skin or based on the fact that they're a damn rabbit. Yeah, I'll never understand why the rabbit's gonna have tricks. Mm -hmm. That's just. That's just. Now, I could understand why the Cookie Crisp guy couldn't have Cookie Crisp because he was a goddamn criminal. Yeah. I thought he was a pedophile. But... No, that's Captain Crunch. Are you sure? Yes, Captain Crunch loves it. He loves him some lollies. Do I? Do, I don't think I want to ask. Don't you don't know what lollies are? I don't want to ask. Well, you didn't ask, but you're going to get the answer. Lollies is short for a lollycon, which is uh, named after Lolita, which I'm sure you've read Lolita. You're so well read, right? I'm not well read. Well, ask Jacoby. He's so well read. I've read Lolita. And the sequel, Lolita, lolita more. Lolita Rides Again? Yeah. Lolita Strikes Back with a Vengeance. Uh, no, it's a, it's a story, it's a disturbing story of a sexualized minor. And Lollicon is the idea that kids could be sexualized, which is horrific. Mm -hmm. And Lollies is just a short, 
shorthand for that. So, going back to it. Oh, yeah. Captain Crutch loves the lollies. God, I didn't want to know. He's all over that. Shenanigans. You'll also notice that, uh, what was it, uh, Captain Crunch has his eyebrows on his hat. Yeah. All right, people watching this, go go in your cabinet, go go or under your bed, wherever you store your Captain Crunch. You know, Cause people keep Captain Crunch in their cabinet. <laughs> wherever you put it, uh, if it's there in that little box in the the Catholic Church where they store the communion wafers and stuff, you know, wherever you store your Captain Crunch, and look at his eyebrows, they're on his damn hat. I don't want to believe you, but I totally believe you. That's the truth. You you will notice it the next time you go to the grocery store. You're like, holy crap! Your eyebrows. Oh, well, shoot! Can I pull this boss off with uh, seven health? No. Yes. I think I'm gonna try it. I have faith. No, I don't have faith. But yeah, it's Krang. I mentioned this because. Uh, Something else reminded me of Ninja Turtles in previous versions. And uh, my older, my dad. <laughs> Does your dad ever, did he ever pick up on a line in a TV show or movie and just say it incessantly? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. We were watching the animated Ninja Turtles show, and there's this part where Krang's like, hey, Damn it. yeah, I'm distracting you. I'm getting my job done. <laughs> Krang's, uh, you know, telling Shredder, hey, go conquer Dimension X. And Shredder, being a little baby, says, I don't want to conquer Dimension X. I, I want to conquer, conquer Earth. <laughs> and oh my goodness, as soon as my dad heard that, it was that was it. He, he said it over and over. So my, my dad, he has health problems, and he'll, he suffers from acid reflux a lot. And the line he'll always repeat is, is uh, I'm coming, Elizabeth. No. Oh. It's a... Uh, Deputy Dog, you ever heard of it? Oh, yeah. The uh, Deputy Dog has this line where he's like, Help! I'm sinking in the creek mud! That's my dad's one line he always goes to. Ah, uh, he should do... San Stanford, or Sanford and Son. Zim Zim Salabim. He does like some Johnny Quest. My dad likes Johnny Quest. Johnny Quest. Shit. There weren't a lot of strong female mo role models in Johnny Quest. Oh, well, apparently you never watched... Johnny Quest, the new generation, whatever it's called, the 90s version, where they had Jesse race band, I think it's race band, your daughter. Oh, were you getting pretty aroused? Well, she was a redhead, so. Oh, oh yeah. Now you got a thing for that. Not that I really pay too much attention, because that'd be creepy. Me? I'm into elderly lesbian Navajos. And hook-handed women. Did you seem to have those in spades? No, I just know a lot. I did a convention for them. Ah, oh, yes. The... I don't know. Hook-handed women convention. Mm -hmm. They didn't see a need for any creative name. <laughs> <laughs> like, why kid around about what this is about? That bird just saved that guy's life. It did. He would have just been slapped around savagely. Oh. Do, 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 do. Go do some power laps. Come on. I'm doing power laps. Alright, let's go. Uh, let's go work out with a series of squat thrusts. I can't believe I lost the fucking Kloshnikov, or whatever that guy's name is. No, that's Krang. Krang, Kloshnikov, you know. Kloshnikov? Kloshnikov. Oh, Kloshnikov's an assault rifle named uh, after Mikhail Kloshnikov, who was a tank commander. See, I know things. I think he was tank commander in World War II, wasn't they? Weren't they using? Well, yeah, you're right. Yep. He was a tank commander, and then after World War II, he designed the Antomont Kalashnikov model 1947. Which is big. Yep. yep. I like turtles. Do you? Yeah. Turtles are great. I believe you. Someone's texting me. Who's texting me at 6 o'clock? Yeah, who's texting you? <laughs> oh, really? 
<laughs> Here's a joke for everybody. For the longest time, I thought my phone was deactivated. Turns out I was that unpopular. <laughs> <God>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a true statement, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> He's not making that up. It was just one of those weird times when nobody wanted anything. It's like, oh, cool. No! I will have my vengeance on your brothers. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Get in there! Yeah, blow it up. Try not to die on your way there. Don't even fight him. Why are you even fighting him? Shh. I wanted a heart. Miles and miles of hearts. No, it's Miles O'Keefe. No, Damien O'Keefe. Because you gotta have heart. Miles, miles, miles. Other heart. people who watch cool stuff will know what I was referring to when I said how many Miles O'Keefe. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's some sort of reference to. Uh, wow, that explosion really slowed down. <laughs> Quit freezing the game, buddy. What are you running, Lee? <laughs> you know, I'm wondering if... Are you got, like, torrents going on your Wii? How the hell did you do that? Hacked. You hacked my... You hacked your Wii to play torrents. Well, that's good, because now the Wii's finally worth something. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, man. Where am I at? I don't know. In a state of sin. But yeah, this sin go. begin. What are you, snag a puss? No, it stays left even. Yes. You fucking suck. <laughs> oh, god damn. <laughs> it's not even an icy floor, you have no excuse. <laughs> Shut up, Leonard. There's a skull in my way. Mm -hmm. I like this guy. Something about him is just really cool. They kind of like pop out of the ground. Like, hey, love us. You know what they look like? Those guys from, um... Dragon Quest, like those, like little blue guys from Dragon Quest. What are you talking about? What Dragon Quest? A really popular Japanese game. So I never played it. It's like a monster hunter sort of thing. Nah, I don't know. I don't really know what Dragon Quest is either. Wow, you just killed all those guys. That's so cool. I love, I love big room clearing attacks. Bombos. Like the art of Inazuma. The art of Inazuma or Monsters. Inazuma. Uh, Montezuma's art <laughs> clears out people in a different way. This is very true. I'm going to go ahead and tell you that. Oh, uh. uh, yes. Montezuma. Montezuma, Montezuma. Montezuma, Montezuma, Montezuma. Go down the oh, dance oh, Montezuma. stairs. Don't be cranky. That damn dog is barking. Outside. Don't be cranky. I'm cranky. Oh yeah, you get to do this all over again. Excellent. So mad right now. I hate you, Leonard. No, you don't. You shouldn't. I'm filled with love. I'm like an eclair, except filled with love. Oh, I, I like chocolatey eclairs. Not. Well, I don't even. Want, what do you? I get, you're not chocolate. What are you? Oh, but are here's you, the you're thing. You're a caramel eclair. Is that? What? Yeah. Here's the thing. Not only is there delicious caramel in me as an eclair, there's also like a finger human finger in there. So you will have deliciousness. You gotta be careful to operate around the, the human finger. Tainted meat! Tainted meat! Oh no, it's tasty. I really, uh, I know, it's, it's just little things, but I really like this ice area. I don't know why. It's, mm, it's very sweet. I like how it looks like you're in a tiny little box canyon. Because you got a little snow on top. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. In which case, I'd ask, well, why don't you just climb over the wall and just run across the snow? But, this is cool. Let's run over the wall and some diamond dust, though. So. Oh! Oh! Speaking of snow maps, the best one ever... The best ones ever are the ones where you actually kind of feel cold while playing. Like, you genuinely feel some sort of temperature difference. And that's all psychological, of course. The one that did that for me the most was a uh, Battlefield Four, or was it Three? Three, another good snow map. Yeah, Battlefield Three with the snow map. Oh my goodness! For some reason, I always felt cold when I were playing. The uh, all the Zelda games typically come out at the end, towards the end of the year, like December time, and so when there's a 
the snow level. They're really awesome. Actually, we might just have to play Twilight Princess for um, freaking uh, snowboarding. They're snowboarding in Twilight Princess. Oh, right. Like in Sonic Adventure? No. Well, more like... Uh... Wait, is there snowboarding in Sonic Adventure? Is this gonna be tr- is it going to turn into SSX Tricky? Yeah, it's actually a little bit more like that. I played the newest one. I actually own the newest one. It was... It was it went terrible. Full, it went full microtransactions. Did it really? Yeah, full microtransactions. <laughs> Which, you know, I ain't gonna spend money on SSX Tree. <laughs> no, who would do that? <laughs> out of your damn That's mind. That game is... It's, 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 good it's fun, but... If you, I mean, you don't need to do microtransactions, but well, I'm just, you suffer for a long ass time before you. Well, here's my thing: is like, who's going to pay for microtransactions in this like tricky? I mean, you, if you can unlock the entirety of what you need from it, I I do because I'm MLG. Oh yeah, if you're MLG, straight up. MLG Pro, gangsta. gangsta. Yeah, I, I ran into someone who was MLG the other day. I was playing some multiplayer games. Oh, I was playing uh, Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, this guy, this little kid, was like, oh man, I'm MLG Pro. Don't don't beat me. My dad works at Konami. I was like, I'll bet he does. <laughs> <laughs> so, I you know, kids. I've got I've got this guy who uh working at Konami. He's going to totally mess up my game. Yeah, he's going to delete my save remotely. You know... Maybe it's because I can't really, you know, have that much hindsight, and I look better upon myself in the past, and you probably should. <laughs> but I think I, as a kid, wasn't that much of a shithead that I thought that such a thing you could do is be like, no. oh, oh, my my dad works at the internet. Don't piss me off. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, if you, uh, speaking of MLG, have you talked to uh, Anthony at work about his uh, magic? What? What did he do now? He... Apparently, before he worked there, he used to be professional oh, yeah. magic player. Yeah, he told me that. He was, uh, he was going to go to... Yeah, he was in Vegas tournaments for a while. Yeah. What he was saying. Which, I feel bad for him. Yeah, I, like, out of all the people that work there, that's like his... I feel bad for him only that I, I find Spike players more. Is he a Spike player, though? Yeah. It, well, you kind of have to be a Spike player to be in the competitive circuit. I, can you explain that to me in the audience again? Because I forget what you did. Okay, there's uh, well, there's three personalities. Just like there's three um, uh, gas clouds here. Yeah, gas clouds. Actually, they're kind of like cotton candy demons with eyes sticking out. They're That's cotton cool. candy demons. That's pretty kick ass. Um, That's excellent. Anyway, so there's three personality types. There's Timmy, who like just we're very simplistic. They're like big ass creatures, summoning their big ass dudes. Not yeah. necessarily a bad thing, just simplistic. Um, Johnny's are... Uh, I caught it! Yeah, you hey. caught it. <laughs> well, wait a minute, wait a minute. You got a spiked thing falling at you. Yeah, you would have caught it with your face and it would have gone all the way through. <laughs> all right, so Johnny's... Uh, Johnny's are more creative. They like making puzzles out of their out of their decks. Making, you're, you're a Johnny, right? Yes, I, I enjoy building something weird and fun. Spikes have no personality in terms of their deck build. They only build what wins. They do not care about any sort of flavor or theme. From my perspective, they are. Seven what? Blood. Hydea. Time. Blood. Seven. Seven. Blood. Ether. Are you chanting something with spells? Courage. Nice. Wisdom. Short. Only short time. Short time. Short time. Short. Linking. The. 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 Vanish. Triforce. Wait. No. Sentence fragments. Hold it. Good luck. <laughs> Understand. <laughs> sure, why not? May the way the hero leads to the Triforce and such. Uh, but, Link's not a hero. Alright, so Spikes, Johnny's, and what's the last one? Oh, uh, Timmy's. 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 Timmy's just big stuff. Does Timmy just fall down the wall? Yes, he does. Alright, well, that was a... Let's get to the next one. Lightning thing. You're going to venture to the next dungeon. Apparently. Yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't like Spikes. I think they just ruined the game. Why? Because, you know, it's never fun to play against them. Because they treat everything like they're at a pro tournament. Like, there's no... I don't know. I know I'm. I know I'm generalizing, but I don't care because I've had enough. I've had enough played against enough spikes to realize that I don't like playing against them. Ooh man, I think one of my favorite enemies of all time, Zelda Fame, is uh, is coming up in this dungeon. 
They're known as Wiz Robes. Is that him right there? No. Is that yeah, him? that kind of looks like him, actually. Is that him shaking his moneymaker over there? Yeah. They, uh, they're little, little lizards that, like, will teleport, and they shoot lightning and stuff. They're pretty fantastic. Or fireballs. So. They're, all, they're only in this game. I think the Link's Awakening and the only 3D version of them are in the Wind Temple in um, Wind Waker. They're pretty awesome. We're on to the sixth dungeon. After I get hit by a jackass bird. I'm actually gonna go look for a piece of the heart, because I think there's one right here. Yeah, it looks like you. It looks exactly like you. Man, that's me when I don't shave. No, that's you all the time. Quit ah! <laughs> No! Oh, you ruined it. Totally ruined it, didn't I? Fucking asshole. Oh, no, you can't. Just move the one in the bottom left one to the left. Oh, yeah. That wrong. Ha! Oh, Heartbeats! We have now 16 hearts to go fight the next dungeon with. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Who wants it? Come get it. Oh yeah. Oh night, oh man. Oh night. Are you enjoying yourself? Yeah. You see how it's raining out? Yes. I really hate this rain. Let's do some lightning to stop the rain. Oh, Shh. Well, how would you know to do that? Oh. Because I've beaten the game 20 times. I guess oh, 12. Okay. That, there's a lightning spot right there on the ground. See the lightning medallion? Match. Match. Top left hand corner. Middle screen. I don't see the connection. You don't see the connection? No, 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 no. That's no. bullcrap. No one would ever know to do that. No one would ever know to do that. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I presume so much of the player. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are here at the sixth dungeon of the light world as Link. And, and pause and save and let's. Yeah, and we are going to. Call it a day. We'll have a great time. Love you. Love you lots. Save the game.